the simplest example I can, that we can present is dyadic. So let's have uh, x and b of x. So x takes values 1, 2, 3, 4. And p of x, let's say 0 0.25, 0 0.5. 125, 0.125. Um, so the CDF is just the running sum of all these elements 0 0.25, 0 0.75, 0 0.875. Halfway between this one and the one before it. The one before it here is zero. So what's f bar of x in this case? 0 0.125. Here. 0 0.5. Here it is. I need the binary representations of these guys. What's 0 0.125 in binary? 0 0.001. 0 0.001. 0 0.5 in binary. 0 0.1. 0 0.8125 in binary. Okay, let's work that out together. Um, I have 1.5. This one, well, I can just see immediately that is exactly 0.125 greater than this one. So that's the same binary representation except with 1 in the 1 8th position. By the way, these are now the exact binary representations of those. So 
those two have length. And those two have length four. This is my average length. And that is equal to one plus, that's three quarters, 0 0.75. That is um, two, I think. Is that right? No, it's one. one. So the average length there is two point seven five. Entropy, not too hard to show. Well, actually, let's show it. What's entropy? It is 0 0.5 times log 1 over 0 0.5, which is 1, plus 0.25 times log 1 over 0.25, which is 2, plus 0 0.125, times log 0.125, which is 3, times 2, which is uh, 0.5, plus 0.5, which is 1, plus 3 quarters, which is 1.75. So in fact, we have exactly one bit penalty over, over entry. Now, um, for such a short such a short, uh, or for such a small x, the two bit penalty is fairly enormous. So I could trivially encode this by assigning each of these two bits, and I would get an average length of two bits. Um, but once again, for much, long, for much uh, larger source alphabets with much higher entropy, uh, in much the same way as we showed with, uh, with extending sources, the, um, the extra two bit penalty isn't going to hurt very much. So this was kind of a, not a weak example exactly, but um, all of these binary representations worked out very nicely. Uh, so let's see another example. So, so f of x is for the first element 0.25, second element 0.5, third element 0.7, fourth element 2.85, fifth element 1. f bar of x, first element 0.125. between 0 0.7 and 0.85. 7, 7, 5. Halfway between 0 0.85 and 1. 9, um, What I'm going to do now is I'm going to first get the lengths that I need, because some of these elements will have infinite binary representations. 